Hey, what's up, guys? We are playing, as you can see, the ramp. Um, basically, I've just done the tutorial so far on it, and uh, it is not as easy as it looks. I can tell you that for sure. We're just gonna hop back into uh, the only ramp that I've got here without purchasing um, anything and uh, see if we can't uh, try and figure out how to do this. But it is not a forgiving game. I think I've snapped my ankles like a hundred times just on the tutorial. <laughs> so we'll see uh, how this goes. If we can basically do anything, it would be pretty great. Uh, when you head down the ramp, I guess you want to hit this button over to the right-hand side to descend. But um, kind of memory, like muscle memory makes you want to keep holding that down, but you actually want to release it when you're kind of um, already down the ramp and like in the middle of the ramp and then hit and I guess I think hit, hit it again when you're going back up so it makes you kind of get closer to the board um, it's it's very <clears throat> tough to get the muscle memory down on this <laughs> it is not forgiving if you land the wrong way snap your ankles you'll find out here in just a second so let's get started See, I already messed up. Get a little bit more air time, let go. And use a little uh, turn uh, thing on the bottom there to um, give yourself direction. You have a grind button as well. Oh, see. And then the, even though like the direction arrows, like they're like, they feel like backwards. So it's kind of, it's very difficult to uh, get down because it's just like so muscle memory backwards. It's not like anything I've, I've played as far as the controls. But it, it kind of makes it uh, cool in a way because makes you have to really figure it out and learn it. It's not something you just jump into and uh, can be really good at right away. And I know that there's uh, ways to make it, uh, you know, that it's more difficult to make it harder to do tricks and stuff and actually be good at it. So the ground there, the ground. And then um, I think you can flip the uh, button on the right hand side to, do tricks in the air, but I haven't really figured that out all that well yet. And I know that I think you can also like hit the arrow button while you're in the air, and it does. I mean, it makes you turn, but I don't know. Three sixty off the ramp. <laughs> Poor guy snapped his ankles like a hundred times. I'm trying to get direction down here, huh? It's just so hard to see I got some more air time here. There we go. There we go. Oh, did something different. Oh, 540, okay. That uh, was my first 540. Got a little bit more air time. Yeah, I think I'm getting the best airtime when I just hit it on the way down. Um, and I'm just, or I don't know if I go maybe. I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing it on the way up. I feel like I feel like I am, but I don't know. I was just trying to get some airtime here. Let's not even uh, mess around with the uh, yet. See how high up we can get. Okay. I also feel like I can't turn that fast. Oh my gosh, okay. So I think uh, what I do is pause in the air and just kind of hit the flick the thing up the right hand button and did uh, that kind of grab the board there. So much that you don't know. I 
haven't been able to land a 540 yet. As soon as I land it, I snap my ankles. Grinding is actually, I feel like, almost easier. As soon as you get up to that uh, the side of it, you just hit the uh, hit the grind button, and you're gonna grind, and then you gotta get down, get off. Oh, okay. oh yeah. All right. Now maybe if I um kind of just keep hitting these angles a little bit. I haven't, I keep going up and down, it's, it's difficult, really, let's see, circle, can't even do that, it's like almost harder than freaking grinding, <laughs> just getting that even, getting an even like oval shape going in a circle, like it is. I feel like I get more air time than that. Though. Oh, yeah, bro. I don't have enough ramp. Run out of ramp so quick. Sure, uh, with other maps, there's obviously a lot more that you can do um, with this. I mean, just with this ramp alone, you can do quite a bit that I'm not even figuring out. I mean, I, I understand that you can, I just can't figure it all out yet. So, if you have, uh, you know, a bunch of ramps, a bunch of uh, grinding bars, and um, all that kind of jazz, probably uh, pretty eventful, especially when you understand what you're doing that's part of the fun of it i think is bring out how to actually get good at it not like just a given that's for sure forward slide Say 440. Mm. 60. there. Let's get one more good trick in here. Come on. Come on. A little bit of air time going on. I gotta stop. It's like such a force of habit to hit that button on the way up. Ooh, I tried on 540. Alright, guys. Well, that, uh, Concludes this little tutorial that we did of the ramp. It's a uh, it's pretty um, pretty cool game as far as the uh, controls, um, how it's very uh, difficult, but uh, something you can once you figure it out you can probably get really good at. I'm sure they can do a lot with this. We're just on a simple little first ramp that they give you to practice on. So I know that there are other. Um, ramps that you can purchase right off the bat, but I'm sure they'll come out with uh, a lot of other free ones to test out as uh, they go along. Well, if you like this review, leave it a thumbs up, 
And if you want to see more content like this, let us know in the comments section. And as always, thanks for watching.